Have you ever felt like your hair was flying up while you had a balloon near it? This was caused by electric charges. Electric charges are charged particles that exert force on each other. So how do these particles get charged? Well first, let's talk about elements. An element is a pure substance that cannot be broken down into simpler substances. Elements are made of particles called atoms. Within an atom, there are three types of particles, electrons, neutrons, and protons. Electrons are negatively charged, neutrons are, do, do not have electric charge, and protons exert a positive charge. Protons and neutrons are in the nucleus while the electrons are basically surrounding it on the outside. So objects become charged when electrons move from one object to another. The electric charge that builds up on the surface of the object is called the static charge or static electricity. This occurs because electrons remain very fixed in one location until given a path to escape. If an object has more negatively charged <coughs> particles than the other object, that makes the um, object negatively charged. And if it has more positive, like protons, it's positively charged. And if the count of protons and electrons are equal, then the object is neutral. One way they can get charged is um, through friction, and friction is the force resisting, friction is the force resisting the motion of two surfaces in contact. So when two objects rub against each other, the force of friction can move electrons from one object to another. No electrons are lost during charging, but they are transferred. No electrons are lost during charging, as a result but they are transferred. Rubbing these two um, objects together, they become as charged. a result of rubbing these two um, objects together, they an electron is transferred charged. into another object. It char um, changes the charge. An of electron the object. is transferred into both objects are another neutral object until the charge changes the charge of the object. Both objects are neutral until the charge. Different substances have different abil abilities to hold on to electrons. The ten the tendency of a substance to hold on to electrons is called electron affinity.